What's going on everybody? My name is Chris and welcome back to another exciting episode of Unoriginal Craft. In the last episode, we started constructing uh, my general store here and there's actually been a few changes. For one, I finished off the walls and I also decided to extend this three blocks over. After I put up all the walls in the, the back wall, I noticed this place looked really small. Like seriously, it came the walls started about here. And I don't, it seemed too small, so I'm like, well, I'm going to I'm gonna extend it a little bit. So I decided to do that, and figured there was no point in making you guys all watch that. So I just decided to do that off screen, and then I, like, repositioned everything. So it looks fine now. Um, I added, you know, more support beams. Uh, I also started putting corner pieces on here, and then I accidentally placed a stair here. I'm like, oh, that looks kind of cool. I mean, it adds a new layer, so I might actually try that out and see what that looks like. Although, I guess that's kind of a thing I could have done off screen as well, but I never really thought to wait. Okay, it's like that, yeah. Like, that looks pretty cool. Like, it adds a new layer to it, doesn't it? And it doesn't make it look so, you know, floaty since, you know, it can see under the entire thing, which is a bit weird. Um, I have a bit of sad news. Well, more for me more than for you. I came over here yesterday. Um, you guys are actually seeing this the day after I recorded it. And I noticed this block was broken here, and <gasps> the villager was still in there at the time, but this block was broken, and he seemed okay, so I'm like, ah, oh, people, why why would you open this and just leave it? I, mean, I guess it could have been Enderman, actually, technically, but I don't know, That's, that seems too unlikely, I guess. And then I came over here literally, like, 20 seconds before recording this, I'm like, I don't hear any guys. And I looked inside, but shouldn't he be, like, if he was hit by a zombie... I know like, they turned to a zombie, but would he, would he despawn after that? I mean, I guess, may maybe, I guess so, right? I'm not entirely sure, but, uh, yeah, so I'm actually kind of really sad and kind of angry about that. I hate when people just do stuff like that and then they don't, like, fess up to it. I know, it's incredibly image. Oh, yeah, I actually completely forgot about this. Hey, guys, after watching my video back, I realized my bed plan killed Chris and Swipe, so make up for it. You get a diamond! Yay! What's good, really? I, I guess I'm supposed to say really sorry for killing you too. To be fair, I... Th to be fair, though, I did warn you. So, in my chest, I... Well, whoa, four diamonds. Where the heck did I get the other two diamonds? I know there is... Di oh, I guess everyone else took those already. Oh, yeah, this is Nova's stuff that I gave to, um, after... The server reset, I spawned all this in because, you know, when I reset the server, everyone's ender chest and all their inventories were gone, so I had to get everyone. Oh, see, Swiper didn't take his yet either. Um, hello, Roman. Hello, are you a Roman? Yeah, actually, I, this is, actually, I really like this idea, having, like, a male horse. It's actually really cool. It's like, kind of like a little mascot for the male place. That, you know, no one's been using this properly, including myself. Um, we put stuff in our chests, but then we never actually pay. <laughs> Uh, it's more of like a holding tank to be honest, but I feel really bad. I feel like I should like give Kenny like a whole bunch of diamonds or something just because I've been kind of abusing our mailing service. Do I solve my stuff in here? Okay. Um, I was like, wait a minute. I could have sworn I had more acacia wood in here, but I guess I don't really know that. Hmm. We've got a thief on the loose. There's a Ponzi raid or something. So I guess I'm gonna break all these and replace them with stairs and after we're done with that we're gonna start on more of the putting up the place I guess so in a s I'll see you guys after I've finished up oh, I was like why is that stair there but <laughs> the stair is there because of these indents in the floor that's so we can like see outside although that'd be kind of cool wouldn't it well maybe not I mean, that could be like a little mouse hole, mice get in through, through uh, excuse me, mouse, mice get in through there, holy crap, that, my throat just like seized up for a second there. Alright, so I'm gonna finish this up, and I'll see you guys soon. There we go, is what I was going to say, but then it ruined my life and dreams! Game! Thank you, sheesh! Um, I'm probably gonna do the same thing for this back wall, but it's a bit crowded back here for now And I gotta push this mountain back a bit still because I do eventually want to do some back here Actually as soon as I'm done with the inside of this building, but it's definitely my main priority to get this store up and running So I'm gonna do as much of that as I can today 
Starting with uh, windows. Hmm. See. Hmm. See me. <laughs> I don't know how big I should make the windows. Really. That's okay, right? My axe is nearly broken as well, which kind of sucks. I mean, we kind of cut into the support beam here, but I guess that's not that big of a deal. I mean, as long as it goes like here and it's like a full door frame, which it is still. Maybe I'll use these diamonds to make another axe. Because that looks pretty good. By the way, today we're on with absolutely nobody. Mostly because right now, this is the middle of the day. It's 2 p.m. Oops. That's, that's not what I want to do. Although, that might... Well, no. It doesn't really make sense to have... Um, floor windows for this particular thing, I guess. I mean, who does floor windows? <laughs> I know, right? Nobody. <laughs> yeah. And I'll see you. And we didn't bring any glass either, so I'll have to make a trip back and grab myself some glass. Although, it does kind of bug me. The w the windows go right to this. But I do kind of want them to be long. Because I know it's general... Well, actually, general stores often don't even have windows, to be honest. But mine's gonna... But, I mean, it looks fine from here, because it goes to the corner there, but on the inside, it's, it, like, goes right into the wall, which is kind of strange. But I guess not really. I mean, in the real world, people do this all the time, so it shouldn't really be that big of a deal. Um, hmm. Whoa, I think I lagged a bit. I thought I was facing this wall. I was like, wait a minute, this looks different. Um, we'll place another window here. And there we go. I mean, that's not centered, but, well, should we make it centered? Hmm. That's the thing too, like, seriously, general, or, like, I, most, like, old-fashioned general stores, on, they don't have windows, like, at all. Uh, I guess this is the center right here. So, should be something like this. Assuming we want to do the center, I want all this wood, I'm really low. This, this is all my acacia, I only have the 65 planks now, actually. 65! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, what? It's like, look at that. I hit right here, and for some reason, it opened up the crafting table. That was a weird, man. All right, we want to do a whoop. Open this up. There we go. We'll add more windows there. But for now, I just want to make sure that I know where the windows are. Okay. Hmm. Now, what we should actually do is set up all the chests. Do I have any wood to set up the chests with? We have a bunch of oak wood. I know for the most part, oak wood is... It's not that easy to come by. Well, it is easy to come by. I mean, it's literally everywhere. But, I mean, it's it's kind of annoying to chop down. Especially when you get the giant trees. Oh, so, oh, there we go. Dark oak wood. I know this is, like, the best wood right now to really do anything with. And I see... Uh, I, I saw something outside. I was like, what the heck is that? And it turned out to be a leaf fluttering in the wind. <laughs> Oh, that's not what I want to do. How can that happen sometimes? Like, see, it's making one. Well, as soon as I let go, it all disappears. What's the point of that? I don't know. I have yet to figure that out. I don't know what it is, and it's really confusing to me, and my phone's going off like crazy. Um, eight. I don't know how many chests we need. Well, yeah, sure, let's make an uneven number. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> um, hmm. I wanted to kind of make, like, a sh like shelves, I guess. But how can we, can we do something with, like, stair? Do we have any stairs in here? We're probably going to change this around. But I, I, I want, just want to do this just for testing purposes. So if we did something like... No, that's not going to work, is it? And then I was thinking, like... Um, hmm. Oops, that's not what I want to do. Like, something like... No, because that's not going to work, is it? Oops. I want to do this. What if we place like a fence here? Is that gonna do anything for me? I want yeah, I wanna do like shelves and then put like chests in there. Like well well like, could I fit a chest in there? I don't think I can't wait. Where where the heck are my chests? They're there. There my chests. No, see they just place right there. That is a full block in between though. So hold on, let's just see if we can like Ah well but wait, can you open Oh you can't open it! Okay. That's cool. Bro. <laughs> Do I have enough room, though? Hmm. So now my issue becomes, I don't think I'm going to have enough room to do this, to be honest. Huh. Because I need... Oh, I'm definitely not going to have enough room. Because I want to have, like, a selling section. Well, I guess I could have aisles, though. Like, how many aisles can I have here? Hmm. Because, yeah, because, I mean, we can't really place chests like this. 
Because no, I, I don't really see the point of giving people a full two chests. Because no one's going to sell that many things, right? Like, this store is mostly going to be used for, like, if someone gets, like, a, an extra silk touch pick that they don't want. Then they can come here and sell it for monies. Hmm. Now, I have to actually, I'm going to think about this, and I'll get back to you guys in a second. Because I really got to consider here how exactly I want to do this. So, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So, I decided I'm going to actually pull this back, probably against the wall, because I think I'm going to want to have four rows here, with each row being, like, shown where this is. And I do want some, like, actual space, because, I mean, otherwise, I'm, I'm going to probably have to change the entrance and exit to one door, though. Because, though. honestly, it's this place is too small to do anything that much bigger. And I don't really want to extend this place anymore, just because I don't want this to be a massive shop and spawn, because, like, that, that's kind of rude to ta ta ta, -ta, -ta, -ta. To take up all the spawn space. What's with me and stuttering lately? Seriously, I don't stutter in real life. I swear, guys. It's only when I'm, like, talking. There's pressure on me to keep talking. <sighs> but, um, hmm. So, I'm going to push all this back. However, I did want to test the other stairs. Since this, I definitely didn't want to have it, um, birch. <coughs> oh, birch wood stairs. Ooh, although that looks kind of neat. <coughs> Uh, excuse me. I hate it when I sneeze in recordings. Like, is that really necessary? <sighs> uh, oh, I also, hmm, I'm probably going to push this back too, to be honest. And I guess it's going to each be like this big as well. Oh, that looks neat. I like it. I don't even mean to really do any of this, actually. But I definitely do want this like middle stuff changed out to... Well... That doesn't look too bad, actually. Right? I mean, I really... I'm not the correct person to ask... Or to, like, be like... Oh, this pattern looks great. But to be honest, like, that doesn't look half bad. That, oh, that, that looks neat. Should I change this, though? I don't really know if I should change these. Do I have any planks on me other than... Oh, I have spruce wood planks. Let's try those out. Of course, I like the jungle wood because... I mean, I don't have any of the jungle wood on me. I, do, I don't even know how I got four stairs on... Are those... Wait a minute, are those acacia? Oh, it's acacia wood. For some reason, I thought it was jungle wood. I'm like, well, how the heck did I even get that? I didn't bring any jungle wood here. But I guess that, that, that answers my question. Alright. Oh, come on, really? Oh, I was like inside of that. That was weird. I remember the first time I was inside a um, spruce wood plank. Oh, our slab, rather. <laughs> Okay, that's not bad. And see, what I want to do is I want to have, like... I originally wanted to have, like, one side of the shop have, like, be where everyone sells their stuff. And one side of the shop be where everyone buys their stuff. But I don't really think that's going to work anymore just because of space restraints. And I would literally have to double the chest. Plus, I have to take into account, like, I eventually want, like, 20 plus members on the server. So, I really have to be careful of, you know, like, well, I want to be able to expand it later. So, unfortunately, I'm going to probably have to do it, like... The top row is for selling and the bottom row is for buying or something like that. So, but like everyone will have their own chest. Like for example, this could be, I don't know, um, like uh, Mr. Green Hippo's chest. And this could be like Kenny's chest and Judah's chest, etc, etc. Uh, but this doesn't look half bad. Wait, what a minute. What a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> what if we do... That is not what I wanted to do at all, actually. I want to do the upstair, upside down stair plank thing. How do I words... How do I words, guys? I don't know how to words. There we go. Okay. What if we did something like that? That's not what I wanted to do. Dang it! Why do you fall upstairs when you shift on, though? Come on, really? <sighs> Fix your game! Dinner bone. I'm sorry. Um, hmm. Okay, we're, well, this is annoying. Should I just dirt pillar? Let's just dirt pillar at this point, seriously. My glasses are falling down my face. Really? Oh. <sighs> I was, like, in one F1 mode. And then I pressed F1 mode to get out of it, and it kept me in it for some strange reason. Nobody understands why. Okay. Spruce wood. Okay, then I get rid of all this crap. I just wanted to see if I'd like that better. Well, I guess we have to do more of it to really see if we like it better, don't we? Hmm. Okay, well, I'll fit around with the patterns, and I'll see you guys probably after all these all the aisles are constructed. Because, I mean, now that you know kind of what I'm doing, I'm going to try the stairs... See if I like that better. If not, then, well, you'll see that momentarily. <laughs> oh, you know what I just realized by a complete accident? 
I can do selling and um separate uh, like separate selling and tra and buying chests. Uh, because do I have any um, fences? There we go. Uh, because I could place chests on top. I never thought about extending it upwards. Holy crap! I'm a freaking genius. I'm a freaking genius. Will that work though? It does work. Okay, I'm just making sure. I thought it would work, but you never know with this crazy game. And I really wish I'd stop accidentally placing stuff. But it would not be me if I didn't. Like, that doesn't look half bad, does it? Minus the fact that this is in the wall. I'm moving this over one space. Which is kind of a pity since I did kind of want to have more room, I guess. Like, I want to have, like, walking distance. But I, I'm going to push this back to the wall and one space this way. Just so, like, you can actually walk in here. Because otherwise it feels really claustrophobic already. But I like this idea a lot. Um, I guess I'm just going to be using stairs for... Wait, did I, do I like that idea better? Get out of here. That's not a bad idea, to be honest. How did that even happen? Well, actually, I know exactly how it happened, but still, come on now. Come off of it. As a badge would say. I've been saying that a lot lately. Um, W92 badge says that. And for some reason, I've just been saying it a lot. <laughs> I don't know. I, I like the phrase, come off of it. In a very British accent. Oh, come off of it. It just sounds really hilarious to me for some reason. That's not bad. I like that. And then, like, above each of these places, you... Okay, okay, that go doesn't come anywhere near. For example, this might say, uh... Uh, I don't know, Mr. Mr. Green. Well, that's not even his name in game, but, you know, this is just a test. So, forget the fact that it's... Well, hmm, that's not really... What if I place it in front instead, like here? Mr. Green Hip... Po... I like that better, I think. Actually, I like that better, but you can't really read it from down here, so I'm probably going to have to go with this. Or I can even place it on the chest, I guess. Mr. Green Hippo. I'm using him as my example here. Mr. Green Hippo. Oh, I was like, can you access the chest? No, you have to click below the sign. Okay, I think for the most part, I'm going to have to go with the bottom sign here, which is kind of a pity. Maybe I could even place a sign in front here, I guess, if I wanted to. Well, I don't know if I like that idea either. Hmm. Okay, let's take these down and see how we like this. I really want to finish this this store in this episode, just so I can get it up and running, because it needs to get up and running. That's not bad. I like this pattern. I think I'm going to go with this, guys. So I'm going to construct four aisles on this, and I'll see you guys once that is done and over with. If I could grab the freaking sign. Thank you. And done, kind of. So I ended up pushing the building back an entire two blocks because I'm like, well, you know what? I mean, I really don't have enough room and I really wish I could push the building two blocks that way and two blocks that way as well. But I definitely, I don't want to make this building too big. I definitely feel like, I like how we could, someone could obviously fit a story in between here. But if I move this much more, then someone won't be able to fit a story here in the future. And it'll just be a big, like, an Owens, and uh, so I don't want to bother with that. Um, but yeah, so, let's take a look at what we got here. Um, uh, I actually have two things going on here. Um, it's either this, like, when you walk in, and you go in between the aisles, and it's like, oh, well, this kind of sucks, because it's like, it's facing the wrong way, and I really wish we could put, like, another thing here. We really could, but I really don't want to, because it would look really ugly. And it's not really, the aisles aren't centered, but I kind of did that on purpose. Um, I don't know, I, I just, I really wanted there to be two blocks of space at least here. There's three blocks here. Um, there's three blocks, uh, I've left a lot of space here because I want to have like a cashier kind of guy here. Even though he's not going to really have a purpose, minus he's going to hold the rules with them. For when people like come in here and like, actually it explains how the store works. Since I haven't really explained how this works too well, but I... But actually, I did this to compare, by the way. But I'm going to explore how the wor how the store works once it's all set up. Because I feel like that would be the easiest way um, to do by example. Even though I don't, even in my mind, I don't know exactly what I want how this to work yet. <laughs> I'm still kind of working out the details. Um, where's the other? Okay, there we go. I actually did this differently because I wanted to see which way I liked better. And the waiter is that way, as you can tell by the fact I'm changing all this all around. So I'm going to turn this all around. 
And unfortunately, my timer is done goofed, so I have no idea what we're doing on for time. So I'm going to calculate how much time we've used up, and then I'm going to finish this up. And then we also have to decorate. I want to really want to decorate the wall since these are really freaking plain, I realize. And I do have some ideas to put it on. Um, if you guys have seen general stores before, you'll probably notice something about the walls at those places. What is that I speak of? Well, I guess you'll have to wait and see. But okay, I'm just going to swap this all around and I will see you guys momentarily. And we are pretty much all almost done even. Okay, so I finished um, adjusting everyone's aisles here. Put everyone's name on here, Miss Green Hippo, Judo Zombie Free, Kenny Shell. I never know like what exactly what to put for the name since like their Minecraft name, their YouTube name. So like for example, put my my name and then I put Laura13 since that's my username in game. Which I hate by the way, I'm waiting for freaking Mojang or whatever to make an update to be able to change your name. I can't wait to change it. <laughs> Nova, which is a crazy guy, 107. It's Swiper Snipers. And then, unfortunately, I had to put Deloines over here. Deloine. I still don't know how to pronounce his name, actually, which is kind of a bad thing. But he's been... His computer's been broken for the past few months. So he literally recorded one episode. Then he hasn't been seen since. So that's a bit of a pet, eh? But, um... Hmm. Okay. So. Right now, I, I wish to do a thing... Which includes setting up a counter here for our little villager that's going to be here momentarily. And I actually don't really like that wood. Let's go with it. I just put it there because that's what I had in my bar. Oops. That's not what I'm about. Oh, you see I have an axe in my inventory. My axe actually broke. And I, I just made a new one out of the diamonds I got from Mr. Green Hippo. Which, by the way, I haven't really explained that. Um, what he meant by killing us was he kind of killed us in the Ender Dragon fight by exploding a bed. What an asshole, right? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, to be honest, though, I was actually trying to explode that bed myself far away. So if he didn't explode it, I would have. So I, I don't know. I, I, I feel bad for taking his diamonds, even though like he gave them to us. But seriously, they, I should not like. I was trying to kill him. So <laughs> well, I wasn't trying to kill him per se, but I was trying to kill whoever was in the radius of the blast. Okay, so the plan is to have a villager in here. Um. We can actually make this to a chest. But we should probably keep it. Well, I guess we could break open another one. Uh, we need one chest. Ah, ah, ah. Alright. Seriously, there's so little inventory space. I wish there was like more inventory space or something in this game. Okay. Now we go. And then... I don't freaking know. I feel like we should use oak for this. Do we have any oak wood? I placed a whole bunch of oak wood in the chest outside here. I really hope people don't think this is like a community chest or something, because I mean, this is kind of far from my build, so someone that's like, you know, unexpected might think it's like, you know, a chest just for whoever take whatever, which is kind of a shame if, you know, I have my diamonds and then people are like, oh sweet, there's diamonds in this community chest. <laughs> so that could be a thing. Hmm, okay. I want to go, dun, 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 dun. okay, there we go. Oops, that's not what I wanted, but we'll fix that in a second. Uno momento. There we go. Can we just go? What would happen? Okay, well. Can we... See, that's like, there we go. We don't have an axe anymore. But there's really not much I can take off my bar, so I'm kind of using all this wood to be on. Well, not really, I guess. Not anymore. I was, though. And that's the thing. I was. See, that's a kind of a cool stat. I also got to put a whole bunch of these more into the floor. I just realized that, like, literally just now. I was thinking about it earlier, though. Should I make, like, a trap door or something? I got to put, um cloth or something on here to stop zombies from coming in I think that's how or maybe we should not do that maybe we should just do oh baby zombie could come in here though hmm so that's kind of an issue because we now we're not gonna be able to see the dang guy we're just gonna see a little slit he's like ah <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous I don't know how to stop him though can we put like Maybe clay pots here or something? Well, we definitely need some here, though. And I think, actually, these slabs look the coolest. Just because, you know, we got, the, like, the contrasting slabs here. Hell, we could even probably, like, bring those up another one. No, I'll, I'll leave it. Mm, okay, so we have... We'll, maybe we'll put pots here. I'll put probably two pots here, actually. And I also wanted to place this in here. Actually, I'll place it here. 
There you go. I'll, I'll even give the guy a little walking space so he has a little crafting table. In this chest, I'm going to place the book explaining how um, this, the general store works. I have yet to write that, and I'll probably just have that written out for the next episode. And with that, we're pretty much done, minus, you know, the roof, obviously, but, um, we'll get to that momentarily. I'm gonna put more creases in the floor here, since I definitely don't feel like that's enough. So, one second. Okay, so unfortunately I'm finding we're not gonna be able to finish this in this episode, but I did get a lot done, and by a lot I mean the aisles <laughs> and this little booth thing, and that's really about it. Um, hmm, that's kind of a pity. Oh, yeah, we did do these windows, too, kind of. We at least put in dents in them. I don't know what I want to do about these yet. I still want to put glass here. Although, I did accidentally knock that piece of wood out, and I'm like, hmm, maybe we could put windows up there instead, which is still a distinct possibility, because, I mean, it would get some sunlight in here, and it'd be nice. It'd still, it'd still kind of fail. Like, I definitely see, like, a whole bunch of these old buildings that have the windows way high up, where, like, no one could actually see outside, but they're more for, like, sunlight, I guess. But uh, I guess I'm going to call an episode here. Thanks a lot for watching. If you guys enjoyed, please leave likes for her ready. My name is Chris. In the next episode, we will decorate this place. And if it's not already open, it will be open. I might just open it now because really we do have the fun, the fun, the fundamental, <laughs> the, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? The foundations for like, you know, opening this place. I do need lighting still. I do need decorations on the walls. Um, I do need a roof, obviously. Um, I do need a villager in here, but I will see you guys later. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye!